Hey, what is up, Breaking Family? Sending some positive vibes in your direction. And Detective Pikachu is finally out on DVD and Blu-ray. But along with that comes another Detective Pikachu collection box. And you thought all of them were released, but no, there is one final product. We're about to go inside this store right here, buy that new collection box, as well as the Detective Pikachu Blu-ray because there's even a special promo card inside that Blu-ray. And today's video is also sponsored by CoolStuffInc.com. They sent us a bunch of Detective Pikachu items that we're gonna open up in today's video as well. I'll tell you more about them later, so let's head inside. Let's do it. All right, Breaking Family, we are back here at home and I have a huge announcement to tell you later in today's video, so make sure you stay tuned for that because you are not gonna wanna miss it. So Breaking Family, we have a lot of Pokemon cards to open up in today's video, including the very last that we know of as of right now, Detective Pikachu Collection Box. And then we'll also be taking a look at the promo card that comes exclusively inside this DVD Blu-ray combo of Detective Pikachu. But that's not all. You know your boy Real Breaking Nate has got more in store for you. So CoolStuffInc.com is actually sponsoring today's video and they sent over a Charizard GX collection box from Detective Pikachu as well as a Greninja collection box. And then we have the Detective Pikachu 10 as well. So we're going to be opening up all of this in today's video. So a huge thank you goes to CoolStuffInc.com for sponsoring today's video and sending over all these items right here for us to open up in today's Pokemon card opening. Now, if you've never been to Cool Stuff... <laughs> Did all the lights just flash right there? Is there a Haunter in here? So if you've never been to CoolStuffInc.com before, it is going to be your one-stop shop for all your gaming needs. You're not only going to be able to find Pokemon cards there, but you'll also find other card games as well as board games and things to store your cards such as binders and sleeves. And CoolStuffInc.com is also a great way to pre-order brand new Pokemon sets coming out such as the highly anticipated Hidden Fate set that gets released on August 23rd. So I'll put a link to CoolStuffInc.com in the video description down down below so make sure you go and give them a visit. So what are we waiting for? Let's go ahead and jump into today's Pokemon card opening. Let's go ahead and start off with this DVD Blu-ray combo so we can take a look at the exclusive card that comes inside of this right here. It's a special Pokemon trading card inside and we do get to see what it is. So let me go ahead and try to open this up on camera and not look like a fool. And I look like a fool of course as always. There we go. Trusty scissors. Boom. Now we're getting into it. By the way, I have not obviously watched the Blu-ray or DVD combo special features, but you can see right there on the very back, it does include an alternate opening as well as My Pokemon Adventure, Creating the World of Detective Pikachu Featurettes, Mr. Mime Audio Commentary. I don't know what that's all about. Uh, Ryan Reynolds, Outside the Actor's Studio, and then Music Video. I'm definitely very interested in that Mr. Mime's audio commentary. So inside this combo, you do get a digital download as well as a DVD copy and a Blu-ray copy. And then of course, the special card that comes inside of it. Now we have seen this card before, but this one does have a special Detective Pikachu stamp on it. So if you're interested in collecting every single one of the cards, you are going to need this for your collection. Now this also does come in just the DVD, uh, the DVD version. So if you're not the Blu-ray version, you can just pick up the DVD version and get this card as well. Now let's go into what we're thinking is the very last Detective Pikachu TCG item to be released. So 
I don't know, there could be more, I have no idea. But nothing has been announced and I assume by now if nothing's been announced we're probably not going to see any more Detective Pikachu items. So let's go ahead and open this one up. It does come with some Detective Pikachu booster packs. Ugh as well as some other booster packs, such as Burning Shadows. Let me in. I bought you. I paid all the money for it. Okay, here we go. I'm going to throw this right over there. That was gently that time. Okay, so here is all the cards that come inside of this. Now, we have seen all of these cards as well as they splatter everywhere, but they do have that Detective Pikachu stamp on them as well. Now, I think this one right here is going to be a highly sought-after one because... This was supposed to be a promo at Walmart, and a lot of Walmarts never got them in. Now, the promo version did not have this stamp on it, so this one is a little bit different. But if you did not have this Bulbasaur in your collection, then right here, this collection box is a great way to obtain this to add it in if your Walmart never got one, which from what I was hearing through a lot of tweets and uh, direct messages is a lot of Walmarts did not even get them in or didn't even have a clue that this was supposed to be going on. All right, and you do get this nice Detective Pikachu figure, and what I just now noticed is that it's actually standing on a magnifying glass, which is kind of cool and different than the usual stands that they're on. Very nice. We do have the Snubble inside of that as well. Two Detective Pikachu... Oh, no, three? Three Detective Pikachu booster packs. We have a Burning Shadows, and then a Sun and Moon, as well as the Code Card, which... I'm going to give it to you right now because you deserve it. So hopefully you were the lucky one to get to claim that. Let's go ahead and jump into these booster packs. All right. Trash goes over there. Um, let's go ahead and open up the sun and moon. And like I said, we do have a really big announcement. So make sure you are staying tuned to the very end or close towards the very end of the video. Or maybe I'll drop it in in the middle of the video. But you're not going to want to miss it. That's for sure. All right, let's see what we got. We have an Alolan Meowth, Sandile, Crab Brawler, Drowsy, walking along the beach. How you doing, Drowsy? Grubbin, Energy, ah. Wishy Washy, Alolan Raticate, Dartrix, Reverse Hello, Pass Simeon. Yeah, sure, why not? I will take a Full Art Solgaleo GX. Look at that. Very first pull right there. Very first booster pack. We got a full art Pokemon card already. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's go ahead and sleeve it up. There's the code card, by the way. Whoosh. Where's my sleeves at? Let me grab a sleeve. Here we go. And it's going to go up in the VIP section, the very important Pokemon section right there. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. We're off to a great start, Breaking Family. Already with an ultra rare pull. We have a Jigglypuff, Charmander, Lickitung, and a Mr. Mime. That is our rare from that booster pack and the code card from that. Now, there is only 18 cards inside of Detective Pikachu. So, if you're looking to collect a smaller set, this is definitely the way to go. It's also the first time we were ever seeing CGI or real life Pokemon on a card. Lickitung, Psyduck, the best Pokemon in the entire world. More lol, slacking for our rare, and then another code card. Now the cards that probably most people are seeking after in the set would be Mewtwo as well as Charizard. So hopefully we'll pull one of those in today's Pokemon opening. Magikarp, Charmander, and another Mr. Mime riding its invisible motorcycle. Definitely a very funny part of the movie. And then... There was thunder outside. Did I jump? Did I literally just jump right there? I'm leaving it in. That's funny. All right. There's the code card right there. Now I'm all flustered. Hopefully the power won't go out during today's video. Um, if it does, like maybe do, do we just keep recording? Maybe? I don't know. Morlo, uh, Duskull, Oddish, Tinamo, Mudbray, Energy, ah, Guzma, Solrock, Plumeria, Pikachu, and I already see something right there, Breaking Family. Whoa! Whoa! All right. Okay. First of all, another Ultra Rare. Second of all, it's a Charizard. Nice. Look at that. Two Ultra Rares inside of that one collection box. That is awesome. Charizard GX. 
whoosh, put you right in that sleeve right there, put you in the VIP section, Charizard. You definitely go in the VIP section. So that was actually a really, really good box. And I think I think I paid maybe 20, 25-ish dollars US for that. So not a bad deal. And we got two ultra rares out of it. Let's go ahead and jump into this tin. If I can open it up, I need my trusty sleeves again. And yes, you will probably hear, uh, trusty sleeves, trusty scissors. There we go. You'll probably hear thunder outside during this video, but we're going to keep recording. Oh my goodness. There we go. If I can just get this plastic off. Huh. Plastic. Ah. All right. I got it off. It made me look like a fool. I got a little upset with it, but that's okay. That's okay. All right, this Detective Pikachu tin is probably my favorite Detective Pikachu item that got released because look at all the booster packs that we're getting inside of this. We're getting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two right there. So a total of nine, yay math. But we're also getting this really, really cool looking Detective Pikachu pin and the Detective Pikachu coin. How many times? Can I say Detective Pikachu? We have stickers, and then we have a little notebook right there. And then, of course, you get the tin, which you can store cards inside of it if you uh, are wanting to, looking for a place to store your cards. Okay, let's go ahead and jump into these packs. And then you know what I'm going to do after this right here? After this tin, I'm going to tell you what that big announcement is because I can't I can't hold it in any longer. I gotta tell you. I have to tell you, Breaking Family. No, you know what? Matter of fact, I wanna tell you right now. This Friday, which I believe is August 16th, but it's this Friday at the Pokemon World Championships in Washington, DC, for the very, very first time ever, you can come and meet me and Leonhardt at the exact same time, right in front of the Washington Convention Center, right in front of the building, right before you walk in. You can meet both of us at the exact same time at 4 p.m. So make sure you are there this Friday, August 16th at Pokemon World Championships, right in front of the Washington Convention Center, right in front of the building, right before you walk in. It'll be right there in the open, both myself and Leon Hart will be there for the very first time ever together. We'll sign your cards. We'll do pack battles with you. We'll take pictures with you. It is going to be so much fun. This is literally the first time ever that me and Leon Hart are doing a fan meetup together. I cannot believe it's happening. It is going to be so much fun and we hope to see all of you there. I'm excited. I'm, I'm seriously so excited. And the, kind of the, the fun part is, the cool part is, is that you know, me and Lee and Hart are friends, and uh, we've done a lot of collaborations together. We used to have a series uh, that we, a weekly series that we did, oh, nice, Mewtwo, that we did called Budget Battle. Um, and we've also done some other videos together. We've actually never met each other in person. That's the crazy thing. So, this will actually be the first time that me and Lee and Hart are meeting each other, uh, meeting each other in person. Wow, I'm stumbling over my words because I'm so nervous and excited. So hopefully we will see all of you there. Um, I will put up, I probably, I don't know if I put it up uh, when I was talking about earlier, but editing Real Breaking Nate, we'll put it up on the screen, a little bit, a map of where we will be meeting at. So it's just gonna be right in front of the Washington Convention Center in Washington, DC. So right there on the sidewalk, I don't know if it's a sidewalk that runs right in front of it, but that's where we will be meeting. And I'm sure we'll tweet it out or we'll Instagram it out um, as it's about to start. So hopefully we will see you all there 4 p.m. this Friday at Pokemon World Championships 2019 in Washington, D.C. Wow. I, I can't believe it's happening. I literally cannot believe it's happening. Okay. Now that we got that out of the way, whoo! Look at Tongue, Psyduck, and Detective Pikachu, and another code card. You don't know how long we've been holding that one in. Whew, okay. Last Detective Pikachu booster pack for uh, this tin. Uh, we still have two more boxes to go. I'm like lightheaded now that I've uh, just made that announcement. Okay. And we do have Crimson Invasion and Guardians Rising. Let's go ahead and open up this Crimson Invasion to see how lucky we got with this booster pack. Obviously, as you're seeing, I'm uh, giving you every single code card 
from today's Pokemon opening. That's because I do it in every single Pokemon TCG booster pack, booster box, collection box, 10 opening energy. I never keep any of the code cards. I always, always give them to you, the Breaking Family. Sincino, Gladion, and a Beware. Beware? A hollow rare pull. I'll set that over there. I don't even, I don't even want kind of system I have going on over here. These are the rares. These are reverse hollows. All right. I don't know what's going on here at this point. At this point, I've lost all control because of that announcement. All right. Let's try to let's try to get things back on track here. All right. Guardians Rising is our next booster pack. Last one from this tin. Dairy Queen, Mudbray, Salandit, Stuffle, Energy, ah. Choice Band, Vanillish, Whimsicott, Vanillix, and a Lilligant for our rare. I am so excited. All right, I legit thought the power just went off right there. Anyways, as I was saying, I cannot tell you how excited I am to come and meet every single one of you. I'll be filming every day while I'm there, so maybe you'll end up popping up in uh, a vlog that I'm doing while I'm there. Next, we're going into the Greninja GX box. I'm hoping that we're not gonna lose power. It did flicker once already and the air conditioner shut off, which it usually doesn't. So I'm a little nervous that the power is gonna shut off, but we'll see if we can get through this video. All right, there's the code card for that one. Uh, we got one, two, three, four, five Detective Pikachu booster packs. We have the Jumbo, a Jumbo Greninja GX card. And then we have a Crimson Invasion and a Sun and Moon base set. And then our pin, which is right there, the nice Greninja pin. Let me set this over here ever so gently. There we go. All right, Greninja, you can go up there with Charizard and Solgaleo. And let's go ahead and open up Crimson Invasion, Sun and Moon last, then all the Detective Pikachus in between. Kind of like a nice little submarine sandwich. All right, code card right there. Make sure you hit that notification bell icon right at the bottom of your screen. Boom, right there. You could have just done it right there. Um, that way you get notified soon as a new video goes up, uploading multiple videos all throughout the week, every single week. Energy, and especially if you love code cards, you can come here, grab yourself a code card. They do go pretty fast. That's why I suggest hitting that notification bell icon if you're interested in that. Star me and the code card for that one. All right, Detective Pikachu booster packs. I think we've completed this set like a million times by now, but it's always still fun to open up a Pokemon booster pack. Mr. Mime and the code card, plus you're getting code cards for it, so why not? Or code cards with it, so why not? All right, Mr. Mime, you can go right over there. Next one is a Lickitung, Snubble, Jigglypuff, and another Mewtwo. Now, we've not pulled a Charizard yet, so hopefully we can, can you know, complete that mission for today's video. Snubble, how you doing? I think I bent those cards. Uh-oh. Don't drag me through the comments. I promise it was an accident. Oh, and of course it had to be the one with the Charizard in it. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I got, what the thing was is that it was like already kind of open and then I tried to open it up and it just like kind of bent the cards. Ah, uh, oh no. I'm still gonna love it. I'm still gonna give it a nice home. But of course, go figure, it had to be that booster pack. It's that, it's that thunderstorm out there. The thunderstorm in the announcement has got me uh, all jittered up. All right, I got the jitters in my body. Last Detective Pikachu booster pack. Then we still have one more, another Mewtwo. It's like a third Mewtwo. And then a code card. Yeah, it's like a third Mewtwo. All right, Sun and Moon base set, yes. Let's see what we got inside of that one. Let's see if we can get ourselves another ultra rare pull. Zubat, Grumman, Growlithe, Puppleo. Wingle, Energy, Golbat, Dragonair, Poliwhirl, Morlul, Rainbow Rare, Rainbow, whoosh, do like the Spongebob meme, whoosh, Rainbow Rare, Lunala GX in our booster pack, look at that gorgeous, gorgeous card right there, we've actually had extremely Good luck in our booster pack openings today. Let's sleeve up that rainbow rare Pokemon card, Lunala GX. 
look at all of that right there. All right, here we go. Our last box, which is Charizard GX. You can still find these in stores, and I'm pretty sure that Cool Stuff Inc. still has these in stock as well. So if you want to grab one, I suggest you grab one now. Okay. Charizard, how you doing, Charizard? Oh, you can probably hear that thunder out there. And we do have the code card. Code card, goodness, whoosh, put that right over there. Whoosh, put that right over there. And then this trash can go right over there. Oh, and we do have this nice coin. This is metal. Oh, and the tail on the back, I love that. Can you hear that? It is solid metal right there. Okay, I'll set that right over there. We also have our jumbo card of Charizard GX. What do you do with your jumbo cards? I would definitely like to know. Let me know in the comment section down below what you end up doing with your jumbo cards because I personally never know what to do with them. I love them and uh, I don't know. Should I hang them up on the wall or do you have like a binder that you put them all in? Let me know in the comment section down below. I'm just always kind of curious what people do with their jumbo cards. Okay, we have a, I don't even, wasn't even paying attention. Was that Crimson Invasion? Sure, why not? Crimson Invasion. Let's go ahead and see what we got inside of this. Swinub, Swablu, Shellmint, Stuffle, Cacnea, Energy, Zwillis, Gastrodon, Sea of Nothingness, Salandit, and Escavalier for the rare in that one. There's the code card. Go ahead and claim it. Hopefully you're getting some good pulls in your online booster packs. All right, Bulbasaur, Lickitung, Snubble, and another Mewtwo. What is up with this swarm of Mewtwo's in today's opening? Uh, Bulbasaur, Lickitung, Jigglypuff, and another Detective Pikachu. I don't think we've pulled a Greninja yet. Maybe this is the booster pack right here, where we see a Greninja slacking Psyduck, the best Pokemon in the entire world. All right, we are down to three booster packs left. Bulbasaur, Lickitung, Jigglypuff, and a Ludicolo. I probably said that just a little too long, but oh well, I'm weird. I'm hashtag so not cool because I want to be known as the so not cool Pokemon YouTuber. I don't want to be cool. I've been spending too much of my life trying to be cool. I'm embracing being not cool and being weird. That's why I wear this shirt right here that says so not cool because I'm embracing it every single where I go, every single place I go, everywhere I go every single moment of every single day. If you would like to grab a So Not Cool t-shirt and embrace you being So Not Cool as well, there is a link down in my video description down below for my Teespring store. I'm loving, loving this design so much. You've probably seen me wear this shirt a lot because I literally, literally love this So Not Cool shirt. Uh, all right. Last booster pack. Let's see if we can end on a really, really big note. We have Dairy Queen, Wishy Washy, Gumi. Where's that Gumi squad at? Jigma. Oh, 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 oh. Jigglypuff. Right over there. Whimsicott. We have a conservation area. Alolan Graveler. And Toxapex GX ending on an ultra rare Pokemon card pull. Look at this right here. There's the code card right there. Let me sleeve this up. And take a look at everything that we got in today's Pokemon opening. All our nice ultra rares that we got. Toxapec GX, Lunala GX, Rainbow Rare, Charizard GX, and a full art Solgaleo GX. That's kind of interesting. We pulled Solgaleo and Lunala. This was a great day. And don't forget to come and meet me and Leon Hart this Friday at the Pokemon World Championships, August 16th, right outside the Washington Convention Center, right in front of the building, right before you go in. We'll take pictures with you. We'll sign your cards. This is literally the first time ever that me and Leon Hart are doing a fan meetup together. So we'll see you there. And once again, a big thank you to CoolStuffInc.com for spot Sponsoring today's video. All right, Breaking Family, thank you so much for taking the time out of your day to come and hang out with this so not cool person right here. Remember the Pokemon fun does not stop right here. There's many more awesome Pokemon videos right here on this channel. And don't forget, I love every single one of you amazing people all around this world. And don't forget, every single one of you are important in this world and every single one of you are loved and I love every single one of you. I'll see all of you, all of you awesome people in the next video. Do it with me now. Peace, love, and a high five.